Hey, what's up guys? Meal Skull here. Welcome back to Space Engineers episode 80. Oh, hold on. I'll be right back. All right. Sorry about that. Um, volume. <laughs> when we left off, we oh, oh, hold on. Hold on. Muley, 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 you're getting ahead of yourself. Wave to the nice people. Hello. <laughs> okay. Now we're good. Um, yeah, when we left off, we built some walls. It's going. I ended here. Let's come out here. Let's take a look-see. So yeah, we got some walls. Um, it's going. It's going all right. Still got to do some work on them. Uh, but it seems like they're going okay. Got all the way. Gosh, it's like the back half of the ship is pretty much done. And yeah, that's going to get really old. Um, I heard in a comment that it's because we have conveyors on Earth still. And the game's still trying to load those. Even though they're that far away. Or it's still trying to update the blocks, basically. Um, so yeah, maybe a weapon test is in order. <laughs> uh, yeah, today we're going to continue building some stuff. I really hope that doesn't continue for the recording, but I'm afraid it probably will. Unknown signal. 3.63 kilometers. Is it worth it? I think it'd be a good idea to do that. What do we got here? Ah, uh, do I feel like taking a ship? I kind of do. No, not after the last time. Let's just go for it. Um, Oxygen's good. Hydrogen's good. Okay, let's go. We're gonna go this way. Cause yeah, I'm totally into these things. Um, Cause yeah, they're just awesome. Uh, I don't know why, if my skins got reset, but I thought I had a... Rainbow Grinder. Hmm. Whatever. We're going for it. Maybe we'll get something good. Maybe not. It's kind of luck of the draw, but that's all right. I think these are a pretty cool addition to the game. All right, it's right down here. Boy, that is annoying. Okay. Um, I see you. Why do you look so different? LCD panels. Um, is there a button? There she be. There it is. And push the button. Try your luck. Here we go. <gasps> Aw, bummer. Oh, there is a small cargo container. What, can I not destroy this anymore? Ooh, I sure can. Okay. Yes, please, uranium. A couple computers, construction components, and interior plates. Beautiful. Okay. Um... Hi, business shipment. The base is over there. Okay. Let's go home. Let's get some uh, things built. Because, yeah, we still have to think about defense uh, for the ship. And we also have to think about um, getting the walls on. Getting this thing airtight someday. And getting ice. So yeah, there's still a lot to do, and we still need some, to figure out some things like solar power. Um, I know we have a bunch of reactors, and I could just get a whole bunch of uranium, but... But yeah, that doesn't sound very fun. I like solar panels. <laughs> I like mining for uranium too, but you know. I think the most basic thing I can do is finish off... 
this section. Just get this to there and then boxed in and then all we have to do is the cockpit and kind of a transition here. Uh, still haven't... Oh, hey, I did have another idea. I was gonna tell you guys. Uh, the spoon is dead. But I have another idea for this conveyor here. We could drop it down and I say we build a fighter what do you guys think? Because we do, we, this is going to be our exploration vessel now. Um, we do have a small drone and we do have a mining ship which cover the expor exploration aspect of our small ships. But I think an actual fighter would be pretty cool. Something to go out and shoot some stuff. Um, some sort of defensive capability away from this. Because we can automate turrets and stuff, but then we can have something that we can fly around in. I think that would be pretty sweet. Tell me what you guys think. Anyway, on to some building. Let's do this. Okay, um, what do I have on me? A whole bunch of junk. I guess what I should do is just, uh, do I have any? There's, there's a large reactor. It's got lots of stuff in it. That's... Sure. I don't know which reactor that is, but you know. You know. Alright, so, um, as far as this floor goes, what do we want to do? I was thinking about leaving these here. Um, the reason for these gaps, I was thinking about this too, is maybe, like, we drill... Is it safe here? Um... Yeah, okay. So, these gaps here. What I say we do with these gaps, you guys might like this idea, is we, um... Oh god, that is gonna... That is killing me right now. Um, we put in some... Blast doors. Now, Muley, why would you... Why would you put blast doors in here? Well, what I'm thinking is... If we ever get into something that's pretty hairy, like... You know, there's we're we're getting shot out pretty bad. We have an emergency switch that we hit that raises blast doors up two blocks, and then it just pr creates a little bit of a shield, kind of a blast shield, um, just so you don't have that a gla like glass between you and a hail of bullets. Um, and even if the air goes out, there's still this little shield here to help. I think that would be pretty cool. <clears throat> but yeah, tell me what you guys think of that. Uh, anyway, I think we can continue that on too. So let's see. Maybe we should work on that a bit. So we just want like one layer blast shield basically. So we'll go something like... Well, that covers the frontal assault. Let's go like this. We come straight back. Uh, we have a conveyor. Well, let's see. We have a cargo container here. I think it's hooked up to everything. Should be anyway. Let's um go down to our large cargo. Yeah, it's hooked up. So, hmm, we could convey through that if we need to, which means we can cover this up. Oh yeah, it's hooked up. It's not redundant, but. That's not hard to do. Um, actually, that's all we really need is air, so that's fine. We'll just cover this up. And we'll probably do a cover here, too. I don't want to cover it fully. Um, how would we do that? Let's see. Can I fit through there? I sure can. That's what we'll do there. Okay, so we do something like this, and then we have our full block, right? Let's come over here and uh, copy. So what did I do exactly? So one block there. Okay, so I just did it from here back, right? Right. 
There we go. Actually... That wouldn't look too bad, I don't think. Beautiful. Still a business shipment. Still going away. Perfect. Okay. Well, um... Guess that's light armor. Cool, and that gives us our wall. And that's fine. I think that's alright. Um... I don't want to weld them up quite yet. We'll wait on that. Yeah, that kind of gives us the open thing. And then we've got access to this if we need it. And it's kind of tucked away, which is nice. We could actually probably put a light here. Create a little ambient lighting. Um. Yeah. Okay, so. Let's see here. I guess we just continue. Well, let's see. We have this. We have to think about this transition. So. How would we dip it in from here? Um, something like this. So we'd go... I have to go down with it. Now I told you guys, I'm not great at this part of the build. Uh, I end up just placing blocks to get it done usually, but I'm trying to be a little more careful just so that this looks good because this is going to be my first ever um, upload on the Steam Workshop, so <laughs> yeah, ever. <laughs> Should have done the spoon. That's alright. Okay, that kind of dips it in and down right let's see we got it that way and we do hmm okay I want this to let's see this is gonna be flat I think right here so this is gonna come over to There, right? So let's see, this one would go like this. Then we'd have an inverted corner. No. Would it be a regular corner? I guess a regular block would work there then. In that case. Something like that, right? Steps it down just right. That's exactly how I want it. Um, I guess we just go flat here. Like this. Hmm. <clears throat> It's got that weird angle, but I kind of like it. Okay. Now, I have to remember this. <laughs> oh, let's see. We'll have to think about that side. Let's get this figured out. Now, do I want... I kind of want blast... Blast protection all along here. I think that would be pretty cool. Just seal the whole thing up. So, yeah, we'll leave this gap here. Um, one thing we can do, actually, is do this, right? This will all be sealed up. Well, it'll, this is just a seat for the, for the blast doors. But yeah, I think that works. Now, how did I do that? straight from there straight back all the way so right here we go from here all the way 
back, right? Okay, there's a one wide gap there. I think that's how we did it. Did we go to the conveyor on this side or was it... Well, we will go to the conveyor. Let's see, which one was it? It's this one, right? So I'll probably have to weld that. So that's interior block. Can't reach it uh, when it's all surrounded. There we go. Mining transport. Which way you headed? 833, 832. Well, he's going to come right over the base, isn't he? It's almost emergency maneuvers. It's pretty dang close. Okay. It's alright. The, the arc should be ready to go. <laughs> should be. I've said that before, you remember? The spoon? You remember that ship? Me neither. <laughs> Get it? Get it? That's no, alright. Oh, game. Should we go for a trip? Do we need to go on a trip? It's a mining transport. Gosh, it seems like he's coming right here, huh? Very slowly. I think he'll pass. 829. 830? Please? Please? Okay, good. He's not coming here. He's flying away. That's a good sign. Okay, um, back to building. Let's see, what do we got? So on this side, we have to replicate that side. Now what did I do? I went corner, inverted corner, corner. I think that's all I did. So we go this one, go corner, inverted corner, corner, right? I think that's all I did. I think that's all right too. Let's see. Went all the way across and I filled in the gap, right? Hmm. Okay. Okay, I think we got some welding to do. Um, I'm just going to be hand welding this stuff for a bit because we're kind of taking it a step at a time. Tons of steel plates. Right? Just grab steel plates. Then we can get stuff placed at least and then start working from there. So, got that. Which means that's probably going to have to just come straight across. Unless I did an inverted corner there and then well no, this is this is gonna be flat. So I think we can just get all this done safely. Did I miss one back there? You're attached. Might as well. Do 
Should we go for the unknown signal? Probably not. We're okay. Now I know there's blocks underneath, but... I just don't see the point in pulling out the drone right now. While we're kind of doing this design phase. Um, the big walls back there, absolutely, but... This is all kind of just piecework, you know? Okay, got it. Now I thought we were going to cover up <clears throat> parts of the ship, make them airtight, but uh, like all things creative, you just kind of go wherever the brush leads, <laughs> for lack of a better metaphor. There we go. Ooh, I need steel plates. It's a good sign. It means I'm placing metal, baby. Go like this and go steel plates. As many as I can carry. And you, and you, and you, and you. Beautiful. Um, yeah. It's got that kind of angular look. I kind of dig it. Let's go like this. Let's type in. Airtight hangar doors. That's what I'm thinking. I, w I said blast doors. I didn't mean blast doors. I meant these airtight hangar doors um, because they work on a piston, basically. I think that'd be pretty cool if you ask me. Uh, like a so. Flip, flip. Nope, flip, flip. Like this. Let's put you in here like this. I hope you guys are on board this idea. I think this is going to be pretty cool. Um, the front ones we will face this way. Let's see, I went to this one, right? And this one. And these ones were sideways. It might be a little overboard, but, um, yeah, this is my baby, <laughs> and I think this is pretty cool, because then we could just, you know, basically shields up, like, you know, pretty cool. Um, how are we doing on stuff? We're good. Good for this episode. I would get these done, but I don't think I'm going to get them done right now. But yeah, look at that. Getting farther along. Um... I think they're okay there too. Now, the problem with these is I might only want to raise them one block. No, I want them up two blocks because, you know, who knows what we're looking at as far as enemies go. Um, I'm gonna have to do some fancy window tricks to get it to look right. Maybe we'll start windows here and by the time they make it here they'll be up two blocks. Because as you can see, um, can I, yep, they raise up that high, all of them. So yeah, we're going to have to think of something for that. Is that three blocks? No, it's two blocks. Okay. I was going to say, it's BS, man. Ah, 11 minutes. Um, I can make it in way less time than that, but do I want to? Do I feel like doing that? I don't. I don't. I want to kind of work on stuff, so I just want to focus on getting this thing covered up. Ah, uh, maybe throw a window in here. This place is looking pretty dreary. I know it's kind of the hydrogen, well, one of the hydrogen rooms. This place has a ton of hydrogen rooms. Someone pointed that out, too. They said it's going to take a lot of ice trips. I know. I know. Uh, but yeah, you know. I think it's worth it. I really do. I kind of got to fill this in too so we have something flat to work on. Because it's not going to be airtight unless I get this all sealed up. So it'd be something like... Maybe we just... Place blocks where... We can. So like... Uh, 
let's get that welded first before I move on. The ceiling in the gap, basically. Getting something to work with. Oh, at this point. No, 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 we gotta wait because I kind of want a window here so we can see out something, you know, because in here it's looking pretty... It'll feel pretty boxed in without a window there. We still gotta finish doors and air vents and conveyors and all the good stuff. Oh, I forgot to junction that in. That's not hard. Not a big deal. But yeah, there's things to do, my friends. Let's just continue on. We've got about five minutes in this episode, so I'm gonna try and get as much done as I can. Maybe we just work on one plane, just bring it all up to here. It's probably a good idea. Doesn't look the best, but or we're not looking for looks right here. We're trying to seal this in, this gap. And there's that conveyor there, so I think this is probably the best line we can choose, honestly. Maybe have it cut in here. Or we could have cut it in there. Let's see. Hmm. Might throw a conveyor here. I don't know. We do need weapons and we need more brakes. So we got to kind of think of that too. Because all we have is a large ion and a large hydrogen for brakes. Like, that ain't stopping this ship anytime soon. I guess we could throw some up there too. Just out of the cluster. But yeah, it'd be nice to kind of double down on some brakes. Especially ion. Hydrogen, you know, we can kind of live with, uh, without, but the ion is necessary. Maybe we'll just stack one right here. That sounds better than nothing. Uh, you. Can I fit you here? The tall way. What's stopping me? Ah, that thing we built. <laughs> it's worth a shot. Hmm. Think, muley think. I could put it here, but then it kind of kills the cluster look here. Gosh, I don't know. Maybe we just do it? I don't want to just do it like that, though, because then let's just... Oh, I don't know. I don't know. It's not going to look good, I can tell. Right now, I can tell you guys. Right now, it's going to look bad. <laughs> or does it? It kind of covers it up a little bit. Oh, but it's all boxy, isn't it? Stuck in there. I do like it's offset. Because I like offset things that are purposeful. Kind of does protect those a little bit more. It's just one more thruster to shoot through. Which way are you going, buddy? 24, 25. Okay, we're good. Um. That doesn't look horrible. From the side it kind of looks bad, but I think maybe we could throw on something to kind of dress it up like it's pr on purpose. Because it kind of is. It, it really is. <laughs> Let's be honest here. Um, maybe we go something like this. And then we go... Right? Hmm, did I just hit the thruster on accident? Okay, good. Didn't want to do that. Um. Let's see, that would be like that. So maybe... No. I 
I think that that's all right. I think, I think that's okay. It doesn't look natural on the inside, but on the outside, it looks like it's maybe the engineer <coughs> Muley uh, didn't think of everything <laughs> like brakes. <laughs> he just went whoops. <laughs> Okay, that's all right. We'll do it. Do it just to say we did it, right? Um, how did I do that? Let's see. I went corner, then I went inverted, inverted. Correct. Correct. And yeah, I think that's all right. We could kind of tie it in down here, but it kind of ruins the look of this. And I want that to look flat. And yeah, that's all right. That should slow us down a little better, right? Maybe throw one on top, too. I don't know. I don't know. I think we're okay. Um, Because, yeah, once this thing's going, I know we're going to want to stop someday, but... uh. Maybe we just broadside. It's like a pirate ship, right? Hmm. I'm charging up, if you guys don't know. Uh, but yeah, my friends. I think I'm going to call it an episode. So. I want to thank you all for watching. Get rid of this stuff. Uh, yeah, we're getting there. We're building some stuff. But yeah, I want to thank you guys for watching. Leave me a like, comment, favorite, subscribe. Uh, I know only 30% of the people who watch me are subscribed. Shame, shame on you. But yeah, I promise I won't spam your videos if you subscribe. Uh, and I'll see you guys next time, okay? Bye!